So typically I get a call that my daughter is in the hospital and I'd be somewhere in Chicago. As you can see, it's a big city coming from all the way somewhere in that city there. As you can see the Sears Tower right there. Willis Tower, this is look. Cumberland. And I would typically be somewhere in there and I would have to come from the city. And every time they called me, I would be so ecstatic because I would know for some reason that my daughter is in the hospital and she's going to be there overnight. And it was a feeling, I'm sad that she's going through this and I'm worried as a father. But then again, there, I have a place to sleep now. And I would get off the train and let's just be fair, it would not be 8.23 in the morning. It would be literally, let's say, 2 in the morning. I want to say about maybe 1, 2 o'clock, I'd get off the train. So, let me tell you my problem with this is, as I'm going, I would normally be walking and everything is pitch black and I'd have my whatever fix on me because I got to make it through the next day or two staying at the hospital. It's like this walk that I would walk, all these skunks would start jumping out on me and I don't, and it's like no matter how many times I came to the hospital and I'd say maybe out of her lifetime growing into this because she stopped when she got older, but I say maybe five or six times I had to go to the hospital, maybe four or five. But out of those times, every time I ran into skunks, it never got sprayed. Because I would not know what I was gonna do if I got sprayed and had to walk into the hospital to spend the night for the next day or two with my daughter. So I'm so grateful that I did not get sprayed. So it's like they were there and it would be a long walk that I would have with myself. It'd be a long walk where I'd hear noises. The path that I used to take was just straight down E Road and River Road. And uh, but no matter what, it's so dark and there's animals out. Because people got to understand, these animals come out at night. And these critters do not care about you. They will snip and bite at you. Like I've I literally ran into so many different animals. And then when you put the light up to your eyes and you just can just peer across and when you're going down that one road that bends around and it's just so dark and you see all these eyes peering at you and you didn't know it but when you make it you finally get out to that road and you walk you you get to Luton General Hospital parking lot right here you're so happy because you made it finally ah uh,